From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your weather tonight. Hey folks, good evening. Hope you had a nice Sunday. I know I certainly did out there. Very fall-like. But I'll tell you what, we have some Monday blues in store. We're picking up cloud cover late, late tonight and into early tomorrow morning. Lows in the mid-40s, maybe some sprinkles as we head into work around 6, 7, 8 o'clock. Let me show you what I'm talking about on the future cast. We're starting to creep that moisture into the Tennessee Valley. And you'll notice very, 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 very isolated points of moisture across the area tomorrow morning. That's not the issue. The rain is going to come later in the day what I'm thinking here, right? We get this wind out of the south. We're talking mid, maybe upper 60s across the area. I think on average, we'll call it about mid 60s. Then this moisture just moves in and check that out by tomorrow night. We're talking widespread, widespread heavy rain with some mixed uh, batches of storms in there as well, some of which might be on the stronger side. We'll keep an eye on that. Non-thunderstorm wind gusts in excess of 20, 30, 40 miles an hour as well. So we're going to have to watch that as well for the possibility of some uh, small trees, maybe some limbs hitting some power lines, maybe some isolated power outages. We'll have to keep an eye on that there. So yeah, rambunctious system. This thing's going to move through, uh, clear us out pretty nicely behind it. Maybe some wraparound drizzle uh, there with that. Not a huge deal, right? We can deal with that. And then we're actually not doing too very bad behind it, I think, as we head closer to Thanksgiving, Black Friday. Uh, we, we pick up some clouds, sure, but I think we're going to stay mostly dry with temperatures in the mid to upper 50s sticking around behind that. Let me show you the temperature trend there. That's what I'm talking about. Front moves through here in the midweek, but we recovered just a little bit. We'll call it about mid to upper 50s, as I was mentioning there, with temperatures just above freezing for the lows. In fact, I think some of us might see freezing just because you want to give those a couple degrees of wiggle room, right? But uh, nevertheless, I think the next day or two is going to be the wettest, right? I don't think we're seeing any huge rain chances in the extended term past this system. Lows tonight stay in there in the mid 40s across the area. Highs well, yeah, we're starting to see some upper 60s mixed into the batch there. I think we're not doing too bad, not by any stretch of the imagination for the midday portions of the day. But by the time we're heading through the end of the day, check it out here. Rain, rain, go away, come again another day, right? But to be honest with you, I welcome it because we have that drought out there. We need all the help we can get, and we're going to get it. We're going to get a good couple inches of rain when all is said and done with this, but I'm suspecting. Then as we head towards the end of the week, as mentioned, there are those lower to mid 50s sticking around with clouds kind of meandering in the Tennessee Valley. But you know what? That sure as heck beats a cold rain, at least if you ask me. Hope you had a good one. Ben Luna will be back with you tomorrow morning for your wake up weather. And God bless.